Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make the viral longhorn parmesan crusted lamb chop. So let's get started with the video. We're going to begin by making the parmesan mixture for the lamb chops. In a bowl, add one cup of shredded parmesan cheese and a quarter cup of grated parmesan cheese. Then slowly add one cup of heavy cream. This should be the consistency of your parmesan mixture after adding the heavy cream. If it's not like this, add more heavy cream. Once you have finished adding the heavy cream, your parmesan mixture should look like this. When you're finished, set the parmesan mixture to the side. Next, we're going to prepare the breadcrumbs. In a small bowl, add a quarter cup of pink of breadcrumbs, one tablespoon of grated parmesan cheese, one tablespoon of parsley, and two tablespoons of melted butter. Then mix everything together until well combined. When you're finished, set the breadcrumbs to the side. Next, we're going to prepare the lamb chops. Place your lamb chops on a cutting board. Then coat the lamb chops in olive oil. Next, season the lamb chops with steak seasoning, garlic powder, seasoned salt, pepper, and paprika. Make sure your lamb chops are evenly coated in the seasonings. Next, in a large pan over medium-high heat, add olive oil. Then place the lamb chops in the pan and sear them for 3 to 4 minutes on each side. Make sure to sear the fat on the lamb chops as well. Once you finish searing the lamb chops, take them out of the pan and place them on a baking sheet lined with tin foil. Next, add a scoop of the parmesan mixture on top of the lamb chops. Then add the breadcrumbs we prepared before on top as well.
When you're finished, place the lamb chops in the oven at 350 degrees for 5 minutes. Then broil them for another 5 minutes. And that's it! You are all finished making the Parmesan crusted lamb chops. This is optional, but you can also cook some asparagus to go with your lamb chops. In the same pan you cook your lamb chops, add 1 tablespoon of butter. Once the butter has melted, add 6 spears of asparagus. Then season the asparagus with salt and pepper. After seasoning the asparagus, cook them for about 3-4 to four minutes or until tender. Once the asparagus has finished cooking, take them out of the pan and plate everything up. And this is the finished result. These lamb chops were delicious. They were well seasoned, super tender, and the Parmesan crust tasted great on it. The recipe is also really easy to make. Also, if you don't believe that these lamb chops are as good as I say, this is the plate before my mom ate it, and this was the plate after. My mom really liked these lamb chops and said that they were better than the ones she had from Longhorn. So I definitely recommend giving this recipe a try. Alright, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Everything I used in this video will be down in the description below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!